We are using Microsoft Office Word 2007 to do some collaborative editing with documents. In this video, we're going to use Word 2007 to put some information in a footer that may help with collaboration. To start, we're going to come up to the Insert ribbon and choose Footer from the pull-down and once our choices become visible I'm going to choose the blank three column layout although you could use any number of layouts you'd like I now have three placeholders in the first placeholder I could type some text like the name of the the document I'm using however I'm going to automate that by using the quick parts feature and go to field and I'm going to scroll down to file name click that I don't care about the format I'm going to say OK and it put the name of my file in there which is M&M Lab in this case in the center area I'd like to have the date and time so I'll come up on this ribbon to date and time use this particular format showing the date and time and I'm going to make and it asks me the format I would like and in this case I'm going to use the update automatically button is selected and say OK what this does is that if the document is opened and used at another time, it always puts the current date. So when you print the document, you know the day and time it was printed. In the last field, I could put the page numbers manually, but again, I'm going to automate it using the quick parts. Hitting the down arrow, going to field, and I'm going to scroll and I want to pull down to pay the format to be one two three type format then I'm going to put space and OF of then get quick parts again and field and scroll down to one that says num pages and that's the number of pages in my document and again I'll select one two three format say OK and this tells me I'm on page one of five. I'm going to close my hand still header and footer view although I can see them grayed out and if I scroll down page one to page one, two, three and beyond my page numbers are on every page as well as the rest of my footer.